I'm playing Prince Valiant, who is very valiant. He's adventurous and um, wants to save Sleeping Beauty and save the whole kingdom. Um, and he fights dragons and things like that. Well, she doesn't get off to a very good start in life. <laughs> she gets cursed, cursed in her Christian, so, um, and then I, I come in on her 18th birthday, I think. But obviously she's the princess, Princess Belle. Um, I'm not quite sure yet if um, she's a boisterous princess and she's going to be very pretty and do everything that she's told. So I'm looking forward to hearing out a little bit more about that. I am playing Nanny Knot and uh, she is sort of a nanny to everybody. Uh, not only to babies, but also to anybody that she encounters. They get a good squeeze and a hug and she's like a mother figure to everyone. I'm playing Azuriel, which is a good fairy, and um, she is lovely, she likes to get the better of her sister a lot, and she um, she likes to grant wishes, she likes to she likes everything to be nice and the way that it should be. Well, I'm playing bad fairy, but I actually don't think she's bad, I think she's misunderstood. Well, I'm playing a character called Muddles, he's sort of the court jester to the king, and I think he's best pals with Belle. But he's a little, he can be a little bit accident prone and he means well, but he gets a lot of his words muddled up and um, never quite gets it right. But his heart's in the right place and um, the kids will love him. Well, I think, I mean, it's, it's a cliche, but I think it's true. A lot of people don't come to the theatre during the year and certainly as families they don't come very often, unless it's like one of the big kind of musicals and stuff. Yes. So Panto is a chance for them to all come along as a group and have a laugh. And, and hopefully some of the victims, like dads, uh, get picked by their kids and kids love seeing their dads made fools of. So uh, we're hoping for a bit of that this year as well. It's good for children because it's got lots of jokes for them, but also the double entendres is good for the parents mm. as well, so I think it's good for all. I think for myself, I was brought up in Panto and look, I was brought up in Glasgow, so I had, I had three different panels that I could go to and I was really lucky that my mum could take me all the different ones. I think that every house is different. So you never get two shows that are the same because you tend to find when people come together as an audience, they create an identity together very, very quickly and therefore your performance is always slightly different. Sleeping Beauty at Eaton Court in Inverness from the 3rd of December to the 5th of January.